Hi everyone, Neko here. I'm going to be playing Conker's Live and Reloaded. Uh, this is a remake of the original Conker's Bad Fur Day, which is one of the best Nintendo 64 games I have ever played. This is literally my favorite game of all time. You'll, you'll see why. If you haven't seen anything about this, it is just amazing. Um, but yeah, I wish I could play the original one, but I don't have a 64 yet. So I'm going to settle with the remake for the Xbox, but I'm playing on my 360. <laughs> Anyways, let's get started. Um, also, sorry if the screen is stretched because for some reason there's like these borders, black borders on the side that I can't get rid of. I don't know why. It's right there on my screen, which is bothering me. So it's literally just like a square on my screen. And I don't remember having that back then when I used to play, but it's there, it's annoying, and I'd rather not have it on my recording. So, I hope you can settle with it being stretched. I'm sorry. But if not, uh, just let me know, and I'll probably change it back, even though I don't want to. There's Conquer with all his fuzziness. Compared to the 64, it's a major update. <sighs> I miss this game so much. Well, there I am, conquer the king, king of all the land. Who'd have thought that? But how did I come to this, I hear you say? And who are those strange fellows that surround my throne, I hear you also say? Well, it's a long story. Come closer, and I'll tell you. It all started yesterday. What a day that was. It's what I call a bad fur day. And title of the game. Um, but yeah, the fact that all of this happened in one day is pretty crazy. I mean, you'll see with all the stuff that's going on, it's just like, oh, this was done in one day? It's, it's insane. Hi, you've reached like Barry's place. I'm not available to answer the phone, obviously. However, if you leave your like name and number and you sound cute, I may ring you back. Ciao! Hi, Barry. Hello? Barry, if you never pick up. Hello? Oh, anyway. Look, I'm gonna be a bit late. Well, met up with a couple of the guys and they're off tomorrow to some, I don't know, fight some war somewhere. Anyway. Um, I'll see ya. <laughs> Love you. I think she bought it. Conquer! Put the phone down! Oh, hello. Oh. Right. Who's round with it? Yours! What, again? Okay. Can someone lend me a fiver? Uh, uh, I don't feel so good now. <laughs> You guys enjoy yourself and all that, and I'll probably see you sometime next week. I gotta go home. Uh, I'll go this way. Oh, oh, no, that's the toilets. Uh, no, this way. Yeah, that's better. Oh, that didn't look too good tonight. Ooh, ooh. I'm gonna sec. Uh. 
to talk through these cutscenes and at the same time I don't want to be super quiet too. <laughs> well there's that. He got drunk. And now let's see where he goes. Uh, can't quite make it out. Anyway, it seems pretty familiar to me. This way, I suppose. I forgot how on the Xbox they made the whole, they made everything hit the screen, which I thought was pretty cool back then. So you're gonna see like rain, blood, and stuff like that just be on the screen. Uh, other stuff too, I think like honey, if I remember. More milk, Messiah? Someone's not a happy oh. kitty. It's gonna be one of those days. I could quote a lot from this because I've played this so much. Never get tired of it. Although, he doesn't look as drunk as he did on the 64. I mean, you could tell he was drunk. This one, he doesn't look so drunk. But you know, nice graphics though, right? <laughs> I don't feel so good. Oh, Mr. Bear. <laughs> <clears throat> Who are you? Oh, hello. Can you help me? Ugh. Ugh. I I need to get home and go to bed because I don't feel very well at all. Uh, oh, no. 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 Oh, so you can't help me at all? Uh, uh, actually, yeah. Yeah, yes, I can. Maybe. Um, okay. What's your name? Beardy. Beardy? You haven't got a beard. No. It's Birdie. Beardy. I scared Birdies. Okay, Birdie. Um, so how you, can you help me? Right. Let's step over here. Alright. Now I'll go to the other side. Drunk cocker walks so slow. You see those buttons? Yeah. Actually, you'll find that uh, uh, they're called contact sensitive. <laughs> and, uh, uh, well, actually, they uh, uh, press B. Press B. Oh, yeah. The light comes on. Uh, and it makes a nice ting. Right, uh, ting noise. You guys ting. There you go. Uh, no, ting. ting. That's it. That's it? Yeah. Okay, I'll press B. 
Oh, gotta do what Birdie says. You know, always listen to Scarecrow. <laughs> So, what does that mean? It means contact sensitive. It's sensitive to contacts. Try it over there. Okay. Or well, you could try it again. I'm going to try again. I always do this. Oh, I do. The beer. Very, very much. I'm gonna go to bed now. Night, night. Night, night. Okay. Also, the sign says "fake off." <laughs> Where am I going? Where am I going over there? No. Go this way. Come on, Conquer. No. I had to... I thought there was an opening there. There isn't. It's right there. Oh, that's the last time I... Oh, that's the Night last press time me. I drink a drop. <sighs> I thought shoes are blue. They're purple? Oh. Just what I needed. In fact, it would seem to me that these give me just what I need at that moment in time. Oh, I see what he means. Context sensitive. Clever. Oh, and I feel loads better. Right, let's get out of here. Oh, and by the way, if for whatever reason you want to skip all these wonderful cutscenes, just pull the last trigger. But you will have to have watched them at least once. But I would never want to skip them. All right, well, let's check out what they got around here. There's an army hat. And toilet paper. Is there a way I can... This one, there's a way. Uh-huh. Pitchfork. More beer. Milk. Mavis. Is that it? Just... Semi-skimmed. Okay. I am missing. Have you seen this squirrel? No. No, not just here. Oh, smart. <laughs> I was gonna say it's me. I mean, I'm right here. Cones for no reason. I think that's it. I just like looking around though. Well, let's go swimming. Oh, I can't seem to get any further. I'm sure there was something. Ah, yeah. Now I remember. Pull the right trigger down, and I should crouch. Now then. Oh yeah, press A to jump extra high, then press A again to do that funny helicopter tail thing, and that makes me hover. Hmm, I should easily get across that gap now. Are you sure you got that? Yep. Don't have to crouch though. Oh no, I pressed A again, but it didn't work. Well, now you see what happens. Hey, I skipped the part. <laughs> Was not intentional, but you know. <sighs> I meant to press A twice, but it didn't. See, back in the 64, this part here was annoying as shit, because you would always fall. And instead of doing the whole falling down or just that little cutscene and you end up coming back on that rock, no, on the 64, you would actually be down there. And you would have to come back up. Let's talk to this guy. Ah, who's this guy? If you think you're coming this way, you can think again. Oh, you're a real charmer. I just want to get past, please. No, 
I don't think so. I've only just got comfy. Have you ever sat on a piece of gothic architecture for 200 years? Gets right up your ass, you know. Thought it was about time to move on to a bridge, say. And I'm not moving now. Isn't it a little bit early in the day to start talking about gothic architecture? Well, if you care to come a bit closer, we can discuss things of another nature. I don't think so. Now I go back. That loading. Yeah. Okay. Go oh, come here. Technically, he could have grabbed it, but like. Hang on a second. This is really no good at all. Part of the game. Hmm. I need a weapon. Ah. Let's just do it. Eeny, meeny, miny, hmm. Mo. The good old frying pan. Weapon. Cool. Oops. Okay, here's the score. Press the B button to equip and put away. Then, once equipped, pull the right trigger to swipe. Are you sure you got that? I mean, obviously, because I pulled it out without you telling me. <laughs> oh, yes, great. I thought the designer said this was just a straight port. What a hack. Now, which one was it? Yeah, this wasn't on the 64 either. They added these guys. Well, they haven't, the guys aren't added. They were in the 64, but the appearing here is new. Freaking. There we go. Come here. Those bad guys are going to be everywhere. meant to fall off here? Hey, weren't you meant to fall off here? Yes, but the designer thought it wise to change the training level a bit. To fool the audience into thinking that the rest of the game would also be different. I'm afraid you'll have to try something else. Hmm. Well, lucky I brought this as well in. Ouch. I don't understand that. Like, how? Hey, Mr. Designer. No more surprises, please. Oh, come on. Really? Plunger with dynamite. Um, I think I know what's gonna happen now. A boom. Oh, oh. Yep, fantastic. Let's go and get some shut eye. Finally. <laughs> I wish. Honestly, I don't even know where the hell he is. And I, actually, a question. He was drunk. How the hell do you end up way over there? In like the middle of like a little, like a little mini island surrounded by water. Like, 
Sister got entrance? Sister got the important. Again. Oh, that's not good, not good. Let me have a look at it for you. Yes, I... I think I see the problem. I will see you what I can do. She must give me a moment, though. I'll come back later. Don't be too long. Uh, I'll be as quick as I can, sir. Because we know what happened last time. <laughs> on it a while, on it a while. I I'll go now. I don't want to have to get the duct tape out again. Uh, uh, yes, wait, no. And uh, I don't want you to get the duct tape out again. Uh, goodbye, goodbye. I don't know what he did to him with duct tape. Duct tape? I'll get him a duct tape. <laughs> ah, I'll come down here, I'll show him what the duct tape is, I'll show him where to stuff it. Stop it. All I do all day is trying to sort his stupid problems out of the Anyway, so what fairy? we? Um, the milk, the milk, the table, the table, the table. Oh, what do we do with this? Um, clean slate, yeah, clean slate. Uh, this, uh, anti-gravity chocolate is kind of working. Uh, that will do, that will do. I don't know about that. Anti-gravity chocolate. Oh boy, my favorite. Every time. I don't know why I always fall there. Wasps <laughs> and bees. Go to the bee. Nasty, nasty wasps! What ever shall we do? My beautiful hive is gone. Hope she's rich, cause oh, I'll oh I didn't read it. it Is this says she is what not pretty. Want me to do about it? Please get it back for us, otherwise I don't know what we're going to do. <laughs> okay, okay, calm down. I'll go and get it for you. Now where is it? Oh, just follow the signs. <laughs> oh, whatever. I'm <laughs> okay. And for some reason, Conqueror is the one who has to solve everyone's problems. Dead. Is there another one? There, there is. All that blood on the screen. No. I don't know what's there. Hey, some wise guy's trying to steal our nice new hive. Come on, boss. Let's go get it. Yeah, let's go. Why do wasps even need this? I never understood that. Can't stop me. Eat that mother butter. Bye bye. Mr. Squirrel, and none of this would have happened if it weren't for that no-good husband of mine. He's gone off, you know, with another woman. 
Oh, really? That doesn't surprise me. What? Nothing. So mean. Anyway, as a reward for your good service to the bee community, I present you with this. Dough, cash, money. for me. Oh, I some of that dough. Yeah, cash prizes. <laughs> Conqueror loves money. And I realize our body parts are still here. Interesting. Okay, so that was just the wasp area. No point of going over there now. Alright, who's this? Looks like uh, one of them skills. I think we should get down there, kick the s out of him. Nah, right, we'll wait till he comes up here, alright. Okay then, yeah. Camera. Hello, it's me again, Mr. Scarecrow Birdie. Right, what seems to be the problem? Oh yes, you need manual. Otherwise, no, that doesn't work. Money, hey, cost you. Oh, how much? Uh, got any Mepsi Pox? What? Don't matter. Actually, uh, I think, uh, well, uh, 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 ten dollar. Long time. You love manual, long time. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. There you go. Manual. Just press B. <laughs> oh, no! Oh, get me out of here! Can hey, you come here? Come on! I want to go back in there. Hurry up! Okay. Suits me. Yeah. Cash. Alright. Ah! Seems to be an instruction book. Oh, I see. It's for the more complex zone. It'll appear the first time you use a more complex zone. And if you need it again, pull the left trigger and press B at the same time. I've never done that. To skip it, just press B. The catapult. Let's see now. Use the right thumbstick to aim, and then the right trigger to fire. That seems simple enough. Okay. So yeah, I've never pulled up the manually. I forget that you can even pull it up again. So yep. Trick, just shoot twice and you kill them. Yep. Still the same. <laughs> Actually, you know what? Well. Smells a bit pooey. Hmm. Let me see. Hmm. Conquer wants to go that way, and I say nope. Oh crap! <laughs> what a stink! I think this calls for a gas mask. Yeah, because this is literally poo mountain. I'll come back later then. That's all I wanted to show. Uh, better move before they come back. Okay. So with that, I'm gonna end this part right here. And I'll start the next one in the next stage. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye!